Here are a set of questions to prepare you for polynomials and specifically remainder theorem based questions. So I have multiple choice questions to begin with and then we'll have a communication, application and thinking problems. Of course in between knowledge based questions. Now there is another folder playlist in which we have covered polynomials in details. Uh, but this specific test paper is all the questions are from previous test papers and I hope you find them very helpful in learning the concepts and reconfirming or reassuring that you are well prepared for your test. Well, here's the first set on multiple choice questions. Question 1. When f of x is divided by x minus a, then f of a is a quotient, f of a is a, the remainder, or f of a is dividend, or f of a is the divisor. Make a choice. Well, I recommend that you should go through these questions, pause the video for the time being, uh, write down your answers, and then look into my solutions. Question 2 is the division relationship. How do you define division? What is division statement? Question 3 is remainder of when you divide some polynomial by another term. Remainder of, this is similar to question 3. Question 5 is if a polynomial p of x is divided by x times x plus 1, then degree of remainder will be what? Go through these questions and make your choices. Here are uh, my solutions. Question 1. When f of x is divided by x minus a, then f of a is f of a is what? f of a is the remainder, correct? So you, that's the best way of finding remainder also. You need to find remainder when a polynomial is divided by a factor. I should not call it a factor, but divided by a term like x minus a. Then f of a gives the value of the remainder. Question 2. The division relationship is? So if you divide a polynomial by x minus b, you get quotient and remainder. Well, out of these statements, uh, this one, I hope you remember, is the one which is appropriate. Question 3. Remainder of 1 minus x cubed divided by 1 plus x. Well, the solution is kind of given in question 1. So when you divide this by this, what should you get? You should try the value of this function at minus 1, right? P of minus 1. So if I put minus 1 here, then I get 1 minus minus 1 cubed, right? Minus 1 is negative. Minus negative, negative becomes positive, right? So you get 2. Therefore, the solution is 2. How about question 4? Remainder of this divided by 2x plus 4. Here, you should feed in 4 divided by 2 minus, which is minus 2. So if I put minus 2 in my polynomial, then what do I get? I get 1 minus minus 2 becomes 1 plus 2 times minus 2 times 3 is 6 minus and minus 6 plus 2 is minus 4, right? So 3 times 4 with a minus sign, minus 12. Question 5. If a polynomial p of x is divided by x times x plus 1, then the degree of remainder will be, well, if you are dividing by this, degree of this term is x square. Therefore, degree of remainder should be anywhere less than 2, correct? So, 1 or less, correct? That is the choice. I hope you get them all and then let's move on to other set of questions on remainder theorem. I hope you learned from it. Thank you.